I'm just going to pinch myself because I want to see if I'm awake. Is this real? Is it not a dream? No. Okay, DoorDash has finally came forward with an answer about flybyers cards in Coles. Yeah, I've been starving them, teasing them, singing off key. Me, me, my, mo, me, moo, my, me. Now, I'm the moderator on the DoorDash Australia Facebook page. We've got over 10,000 members. And constantly, just over time, there's always the question, uh, can I use my flybys card at Coles when I'm doing shop and delivers? Uh, j just for anyone overseas watching or not familiar with it all, a flybys card is kind of like a... Um, rewards program so when you go shopping for groceries for yourself um you scan your flybys cards and you can trade it in for things like gift cards when you build up enough points you can trade it in for the you know like uh, uh kitchen items or even even holidays and stuff like that if you build up heaps of them um so dashes uh in australia uh some of the more savvy ones they've been scanning their own flybys cards uh on customer orders because the customer's not in this store the customer's not scanning their own flybys cards so they're like you know what I'm just going to use it on mine, build up some extra points, you know, kind of, kind of maximize their money. Wait a minute. That's the smartest thing I've ever heard anyone say about anything. And for a long time, there wasn't any verdict from DoorDash. DoorDash steered so clear of this one. Uh, they weren't giving any formal instructions, not doing any email blasts out. And in all fairness, they still haven't done email blasts out properly. Um, but... Now, this is leaked out. So, uh, the Coles shop and deliver orders. Now, they've updated the delivery instructions and they've got an additional note section in there. It says, this is a shop and deliver order. Please use your red card at checkout. All standard stuff. And then they say, please note, and this is new, uh, dashes are not permitted to scan any flybys cards during the order. Doing so may result in having your eligibility for shop and deliver orders revoked. So it's a little bit to unpack here. So the first and foremost, DoorDash actually made a decision about something and they said, uh, yeah, you know what? You should not do that. And it's been going on for like a year, guys. They just could not make a decision around this, but they finally have. So good for DoorDash for finally giving, uh, giving Dashes some direction here. Uh, now, secondly, the thing to unpack uh, is that they have said uh, that your eligibility for shop and deliver uh, uh, orders will be revoked. So, that's not a contract violation, guys. Not a contract violation for using flybys, but you can earn, uh, you can, sorry, you can lose your privilege to do shop and delivers, uh, as if shop and delivers were a privilege anyway, but you can lose doing a certain order type. That's what they're saying here. So you're not going to get deactivated for doing it, but you could not get shop and delivers in the future. But here's my question, and, and this is, and guys, uh, let me know. Let me know in the comments if you have an answer to this or you figure this out, or if you if you know anything more about it. Here's my question: How the fuck does DoorDash know if we're using a Flybys card or not? Because Flybys isn't giving cut, like their data across to DoorDash. It's not linked up through the app or anything like that. Uh, unless the customers contact Coles, ask for like a receipt or something like that, and then want to scan their own flybys cards, sure, maybe, and then they complain to DoorDash saying, oh, it's already been redeemed. Um, maybe, but that is such an edge case thing, guys. It's such a stretch. Dashes, uh, they do not, they're not supposed to put the receipts from the customers in the delivery bags with them. The customers have their own receipts with the pricing that DoorDash has charged. It gets sent through them when they order it to their email and also in their, their application under their receipts. Uh, so the actual receipt from Coles does not go in the bag and that receipt from Coles, it's got a little uh, QR code to scan for flybys. So customers doesn't get customers don't get that. So how does how does DoorDash know? How does DoorDash know? I don't know to be honest, guys. I don't know. I think this is a vain threat from DoorDash. Uh, it is. Uh, it's, it's like, oh, you better not. It's kind of like uh, a bit of a boogeyman situation. Oh, there's a boogeyman in the closet. Just don't open the doors and hoping that we're all children too scared to go open up the closet door at night time in case the boogeyman's in there. I don't think they can tell. The only thing I can think of off the top of my head is is if they're planning to integrate flybys with the Dash, uh, the DoorDash app for the customers, uh, which means customers put in their flybys number when they do a Coles purchase, then the, the flybys points get charged across to the customer's flybys card. Uh, so they get bonuses that way. And maybe, maybe that's a way that they see on marketing to get more customers in through the door using DoorDash because uh, I, I guess a pain point would be from customers saying, well, if I order through DoorDash, 
I don't get to claim in my flybys points. And a lot of people froth their flybys points. So maybe that's something, but I don't think that will be the case because just the time and effort of development to get that get that happening, the integrations between Coles and Flybys and the DoorDash app, it just seems like such a huge project for them to do and sync it all up so that like the correct values are all moving around. Such a huge project for them to do uh, when there's actually no money in it for DoorDash, uh, aside from maybe getting a couple of outlying customers who were like, was like I'm not doing it because I can't use my Flybys, getting them across uh, onto the platform, which... I don't think would really be worth it against that kind of development cost. So yeah, DoorDash made a decision on it. Um, guys, like who who has been using their flybys cards? Um, you can't get a contract violation. You can't get deactivated. They've just stated that there. They say that you can be revoked if you continue to do it. So yeah, I don't know. Um, personally, I haven't. I don't use flybys. I don't have a flybys card or anything like that. But... <laughs> I know people do. I know people have gone and replaced all, all their stuff in their kitchen with flybys points from doing DoorDash. And you know, power to them. Um, it, realistically, like if I use my flybys card from day one uh, of DoorDash when Shop and Delivers first started coming through and it was Coles Express for, uh, starting with, then we moved across to Coles Shopping Centers. If I did from day one, I would probably have a holiday paid for on flybys points be able to like pay for a holiday to Bali or something like that. Um, but yeah, so I don't know, who's gonna be impacted? Do you use Flybys currently when, you, when you're doing shop and delivers? Are you gonna miss it? Are you gonna still keep doing it? Um, what do you guys think? Do you think DoorDash has made the right call here? Uh, because Flybys has got nothing to do with DoorDash. Um, so who is DoorDash to dictate what we can or cannot do with a, a different company? Who are they to say? Who are they to say that we can't use our flybys cards if we choose to use our flybys cards? Sure, like maybe the customer on the very off chance might be upset that it's been redeemed in, but that is very few and far between. So who is DoorDash to say, do not use your flybys cards? Or do you think it's the right call? Do you think DoorDash is doing the right thing here? Let me let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, they finally made a decision. They said no more flybys cards at Coles. What do you guys think? Let, let me know, um, yeah. I'm a, I'm a little bit torn on this one, to be honest. Is it the right thing? Is it not the right thing? I don't know, because I, I don't use a Flywise card, guys. I don't use it. I should have. <laughs> if I did it up to this point, I'd have a holiday paid for, so kind of fucking sucks to be me at this point, but um, <laughs> wish I did. I really wish I did, but yeah, I don't know. Guys, let me know your thoughts. Let me know your thoughts, and I'll catch you on the next one. This is This is